What is going on guys? I am Jehovah and real quick before this awesome video from Rue. Uh, Rue's my buddy and he does some GTA content on his channel and I put a lot of it here on this channel as well. And I'm a big fan of what he does so in order to help him out a little bit I'm going to run a little bit of a... Uh, a promotion so uh, if you guys get done watching this video and you enjoy it check out his link in the description and subscribe to his channel and leave a like on this video and everybody that does that will be automatically entered to win a copy of GTA 5 when it comes out Hey, how did I my Rue 399 and this is the GTA 5 chat show and today we're going to be discussing the pre-ordered edition for GTA 5, whether or not you're going to be getting it and so on and so forth, right? I want to say quick thanks to Jehovah first of all for letting me upload here and if you enjoy GTA 5 come on over to my channel where I've got a lot of discussion going on. Either way, pre-ordered edition for GTA 5. You've been able to pre-order this game for absolutely ages and I mean literally 2011 you could pre-order this game. And you didn't know anything about it, but companies like Game in the UK, Game Station, uh, Game, uh, what's the one? Game Stop, that's it, Game Stop in America. All of these companies were coming up going, oh yes, pre order GTA and that. They didn't tell you a release date, they just wanted to get you in, get your money so you could, you know, so your business, basically, so that, that they make money before the game's even out. That's all it is. You didn't get told what you could get for pre ordering or anything like that. And as far as I'm aware, I don't even think it's been officially announced what you get for pre-ordering, but people would go ahead and do it anyway. So, what I think you would get, a limited number of viewfinders, and what it was, you'd look for a little thing, and you'd see a little image of something from GTA 5, a little bit of plastic really, you look through, you see this little image, you know, it's a hologram type thing, quite nice looking thing, but there's five of them to collect or something like that, one of each maybe, I don't know, you got one at random. Not the best, really. I, I think if you pre-ordered from somewhere like Game or uh, many other companies around, you would get a little uh, poster. And that is quite good. I like the idea of a poster, but you could buy it for a fiver anyway. Now, you're not actually buy it. Uh, the thing is with pre-orders, people make it out to be like some terrible, terrible thing. Okay, But it isn't. It's You just pay your £5 and it's a bit of a deposit. When the game comes out, you just pay the rest. Okay, you know, It's just you put £5 down and you're, you're essentially saying, I'm going to buy the game from your company. That's all it is. People want you to buy their shit. So that's all it is, all right? You know, the, I could buy, I bought the poster for a fiver because I wanted to hang it up. It looked cool. However, if I wanted to, I could say, I'm going to get it from you, definitely, when the game comes out. I didn't want to do that, so I didn't. And to be honest with you, a lot of the time I look at pre-orders and I don't think they're worth it because you don't get enough crap from it, okay? I'm insanely hyped up about GTA 5 insanely I've been doing this now for a year and a half nearly and I'm going absolutely mental about this game but there isn't anything that's drawing me towards pre-ordering this game if there was a super limited edition where you got a load of different stuff and you got the game a week to a fortnight early I would get the pre-order then and let's be honest I'd probably get it for several games Call of Duty Battlefield you know we could list the games off then Bioshock I probably would have got that Far Cry any of these really hyped up games if you were to get the game early for pre-ordering and even paying a little bit more even if you have to pay a tenner to 25 pound more you know I don't mind doing that because I'm gonna get this game earlier than everybody else you don't really get that much at the moment for saying you're going to get a game earlier and pre-ordering a copy considering I can drive down five minutes down the road and I can go and get one you know, and I'm probably going to go and get four copies because I'm going to give a few away. But that that's just how it is. So, I want to know, are you going to pre-order this game? If you are, why? What is drawing you towards it? I mean, I'm, I'm not one for pre-orders. I don't understand it. But I get if you're the person that does, I understand that as well. I mean... It's up to anybody, you know, it's up to individuals to decide. I mean, some sometimes it's good, sometimes it's bad. That's why I want to know. Either way, I've been our Rule 3 and I'm, what do you think about the pre-ordered edition of GTA 5? There hasn't really been that much said about it, but it's kind of one of those things you can do, and it's kind of unofficial. You can pre-order it from Rockstar directly as well, I think, so... Yeah, leave a comment in the comment section below. Obviously, we like those dicks in the comments. And uh, comment over to my channel where I've got a lot of GTA 5. Thanks to Jehovah once again, and I'll see you in a bit.